I'm back. For the love of all things holy, I am back. So, what do I have in the works? Well, recently I've started writing a new fanfic for My Little Pony G5, involving a romance story between Hitch and Zip. Yes, I'm a Hitch Zip shipper. And to be honest, I am really proud of what I'm writing so far. And I have Bella the Pink Savage as my proofreader. And I'm looking for two more. I will ask, though, if I want any of you guys to do it. I already have two people in mind, and if they can't do it, then I will ask. My review for Main Melody in My Little Pony Tell Your Tale will be uploaded pretty soon. It's almost finished. It will be uploaded on my DeviantArt, so be sure to check it out there. And then, outside of ponies, I have recently got into a fantastic new series. And for those of you who know what I'm talking about, congratulations. The series is called 101 Dalmatian Street. That title should make it fairly obvious what this is. It is a spin-off series of 101 Dalmatians. I will make a review for it eventually, but I need to say this right here and right now. I mean, my god! Is this series more clever than it has any right to be or what? Like, guys, for full context, I haven't seen the whole series yet, and I think I'm either 18 to 19 episodes in, and I haven't found a single one that's bad. Yeah, you heard that right. 19 episodes, two segments each, and I haven't found a single one that's bad. Why exactly is this? Well, it has a lot to do with the fact that it subverts expectations, but I want to stay focused. Like I said, I'll be posting reviews of some of the episodes in the future. And I am also going to try my hand at writing a fanfic for 101 Dalmatian Street. I have no idea what it's going to be yet, but I feel like if I will write that, I will put my utmost writing skills to the ultimate test, I am sure. And obviously fan art of 101 Dalmatian Street from me is going to pop up on my DeviantArt every so often. Also, if you haven't seen it yet, then what are you doing watching my update video explaining it? Go watch the series. I promise you it will be one of the best experiences you'll ever have. Speaking of Disney, let's move on to Pixar for a second. So I think at one point I said that I would review Turning Red. Well, sorry to say that video won't be happening. At least, not for now. And even if I do review Turning Red, it's not going to be in a traditional sense. Mainly because, well, yeah, everyone else only seems to have something negative to say about it. And as someone who absolutely adores Turning Red as a movie, I feel rather, I guess you could say alienated. Then again, that seems to be my experience with every movie and TV show that comes out lately. Yeah, so far 2022 has not been the most pleasant viewing experience for me. And I have no idea if I'll review Lightyear. I have no idea if I'll review the MLP New Generation movie or its spring special or its upcoming second special or it's Christmas special. And that's even ignoring everything else that I have more or less been alienated from because everyone else seems to hate something that I like and it seems to work the same way in reverse as well. And yeah, maybe I'll talk about this subject some other time. And then of course, my art that I drew for Shining Through the Shadows is going to be coming out pretty soon when its first episode premieres. So go subscribe to Heartsy Artsy if you haven't already. For now, I'm just fully intent on relaxing for a while and just working on the internet, interacting with my friends. Like, that's all I want to do for a while. These last few ca vacations, they were fun, but uh, they were hectic. 
For now, I'll probably just sit back for a while and have a few calls with some of my friends. Also, there's a little bit of internal trouble in my house. Um, there's a water problem in it, and I'll give you guys an update if that somehow affects me. But aside from that, I'm pretty good. So, see you guys later.